hello friends welcome to the channel today i will show us how we can delete folders and files in android 11 data directory so the first thing i'm going to create my app and please you must note that google if you are creating a production ready app google new policies your app must target android 30 so i'm going to change it to be able to target android 30 and Targeting Android 30 comes with a lot of configuration which schedule doesn't offer by default so I'm going to add this code to my manifest to access all files for Android 10 this code only works in Android 10 when because Android 11 is ignored when we target Android 11. So if you are targeting Android 10, it will be, it will work in Android 11. But when you target Android 11, it could not work in Android 11. So this has been added. So, for instance, I'm going to create a random file. I'm going to create a random file in my data directory. I'm going to create a random file in my data directory. So with that being created, when we open the app, it will request for permission and create that file. So when we click on a button, when we click on a button, our delete button is going to delete the file. Delete the file. Delete the delete our button delete. So when we want to delete, all we just need to do is make reference to the five parts. So I made reference to the five parts. That is all. We're going to be able to delete. So, but that is not all we're going to notice about the changes in Android 11. So if you are targeting Android 11, you still need to sign your app with V2, V2 sign in. I will leave the video link in our, in, I will leave the link to download the app in which I will sign my app with version 2 v2 scheme so we need to sign our out with v2 scheme and i'm using this tool because it supports support and uh, custom key it also supports v2 and v1 scheme so if we have those our app doesn't support v v2 scheme it will uh, install in android 11 when we target api 30. so all we i've already set up my signature I've on it and I've set up my custom key. So when I build my schedule app, I'm going to sign it to V2 scheme. I'm going to sign it with V2 scheme and install so that I can be able to install. Because when you your app has V V1 and target Android 11, the system is going to ignore the APK and just uh, show show a message APK not installed. So your app needs to to have v2 scheme and which i will show you in this video so with the app being installed so we will install the one from schedule sorry i 
and install it you are not supposed to install it all you need to do is come to the sketch where my sc your project id you need to come to your project id let me check for my project id so i'm going to uninstall this one because the signature will change 608 is my project id so i'm going to sign this one zip align after after this we're going to install it i'm going to install this one i'm going to install this one So we are going to install this. I want to also use this medium to beg that video I post here for educational purposes. Don't go making an app that will delete directory of people phone. It's really painful to see what you have saved then. A random app will just delete it. It's not really good. Sometimes we have to be human in making our decisions. Thank you. So the file when I click on allow, the file has been created. So confirm that the file has been created. We are going to check our data directory. We are going to check our data directory. In Android data our package name files this is the file the file that I created in on create so when I click on button when I click on button it's going to delete the file the file has been deleted Thank you guys for watching. Watch my video really motivates me. I can't say how much I'm pleased when I see people watch my video. Please endeavor to share to others. A lot of people don't have ideology of this. I've made a lot of changes in Android 11 according to Play Store policies, according to Google, Google directions. So you share my video help me to reach more audience. Thank you so much and please subscribe. If you want the project, it will be on Sketchly. You can download it from Sketchly. There are a lot of Android 11 projects, Android 11 ready projects, Android 11 access or storage, Android 11 copy files from asset, Android 11 copy files to data directory, copy folder to data directory. You can get them here. Please subscribe. Thank you for watching.